Hey, what's up, Derek and Vinyl Community? Congratulations, man. 2,500. That's awesome. Um, sitting here listening to uh, some Savage Rose, your daily, your daily gift. This woman's voice is really childlike. Um, I picked this up a long time ago, and uh, just got around to listening to it today because I was just trying to go through these shelves. Um, because of your videos, Derek, um, you were doing some psychedelic videos, and I was looking at my shelves and just like everything's so unorganized within my psych, kraut rock, prog rock areas. So you wanted to talk about some things, I guess, that maybe you don't have, or that the members in the VC don't show a lot. Um, you know, after seeing a lot of your collection, it's like impossible to really find stuff that you don't have. Um, I'm sure I have a lot of music you don't have, but the question is if you would be interested in that music. So, I'm going to try to stick to what I've seen you show. Um, I saw you show Damnation 2, and um, I happen to have a copy of The Damnation of Adam Blessing, which I believe came before Damnation 2. And um, if you like Damnation 2, now I haven't heard Damnation 2 because this is all I have. I'm actually on the hunt and search for Damnation 2. I have this one, and this is an amazing, psychedelic, fucking, this is so good. I mean, it really is. Um, it's called The Damnation of Adam Blessing. This is before they changed their name to Damnation, and cut, they were called The Damnation of Adam Blessing. They actually went through a couple name changes, I believe, but this, this album here, um, if you don't have that, Derek, this is something I would definitely vibe with you on, and I think you would really enjoy this. Um, just an amazing record, um, so I had to show that one. Plus, I seen you show, um, and I gotta drop the. I, have to, I guess I'll just start this over. Plus, I seen you show um, Amandu, which I recently just got into myself. But I seen you show. I forget. What, I think I just think you seen you show two Amandu records. So I'm going to show you the two Amandul records that I have, and they're different than the ones you have. So you have two, and I have two. So together we have some really good ones. This one is Wolf City. I believe they're second or third. I don't. Uh, I'd like to say they're, they're third or some. I'm not sure, but I know this is a damn good one. Uh, Gatefold. I think me and you would definitely vibe together on that one, big time. Uh, you already like Amandul and. I don't think, I mean, if you didn't show it, I'm pretty sure you don't have it. I mean, maybe you do, but, uh, I know, and let me show the other Amandul before I go on to the next thing here, get ahead of myself, but uh, here's the next one. This is Carnival in Babylon. I think you'd dig that one, too. I think, uh, me and you would vibe on that. That's, this is a killer one. This is a, I like this one the best out of the two I have. Um, really, really dig this. Awesome, trippy, psychedelic. Uh, I love this gatefold. I mean, that's so awesome. So cool. Um, so I think me and you would get down on that together, too. I think that could be something that, uh, we would vibe with there together. Um, I know you showed 10 years, I think you showed 10 years after. And, I mean, everybody has this record, but, I mean, this is, I think, one of 10 years after's best records. Um, then they were more psychedelic -y. you know, this is definitely, you know, you were talking about psychedelic stuff, this, I think, you know, I mean, obviously you've heard this, and you probably haven't, but we'll listen to this too, because I think we'd like that, um, you showed this, and I'm definitely down with that too, so, got that, um, I wanted to also say, you, you mentioned in your video, when you showed this record, you said somebody else showed this, and you couldn't think about who showed it, and it was me. Um, I showed it in the VC head shop, and if you're digging this, Derek, I'm digging this. This is, oh man. Next to Adam Blessing, this is the second best pickup I've had in a long time. The Damnation Adam Blessing and this have been like the two albums that I really, really, I mean, these two records here have been just two of my most prized pickups in the last month or so, um, definitely just loving those albums, um, so, like, as for stuff you might not have, 
I don't know, Derek. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. How about this one? Here you go. Fear itself. Woman fronted blues psych. I'd say I'd say bluesy psych. If you've never heard this, Derek, I think you'd fucking love this record. And this is not an easy record to find. Um, I've never seen it other than in my collection. Um, that's it. I've never seen anybody show it. Never seen anybody talk about it. Never seen anybody mention it. I think this is the only record they ever made. It's one of those once and done records. I think. I, I could be wrong there. But uh, Fear Itself, um, I don't think the gatefold's too amazing, to be honest with you. But um, this is a killer fucking blue. Like, it's bluesy, psychedelic type stuff. I've listened to this, what I listened to it last week, I think, and, and I think, I mean, I listened to it before that, but I, I put it on just last week. Just a gatefold. And it has an original inner with it, too. But, uh, yeah, this is a killer, this is a killer, killer record. Um, really, really good. Um, search this one out if you can. I'll give you a, a, co a number here. Just in case you wanted, it's DLP two five nine four two. Um, I think you'd dig that. I think we, I think we'd both dig that together. I think that would be a good one. Um, how about some? Well, because I know you, Derek, man, you're just like I am, dude. You're into it all. I mean, really, you, you, you bounce around. I mean, you've showed respect to rap records that I've put up on the internet. Uh, you, you obviously like psychedelic music. You're into Prague and crowd rock. I mean, you're, you're like, you know, most members of the VC, they jump around and listen to all different types of music. I think we dig some Savoy Brown. I'm pretty sure you'd be down with that. Um, what else do I got laying in these stacks here? See if I can find something. I don't really, I did not plan for this video. I kind of just threw it on and figured I'd go from there. Um, here you go. This is one. This is a killer fucking record. This is a, uh, like, proggy rock. Just a reg. I think it's more like just rock. Pato. Pato. 70s. Look at that cover. Look at that. I think you would dig that. I think you would dig the hell out of this. This is great. This is a great fucking record. Um, just a great fucking record. Um, we're going to drop the needle on this one, and we'll see what you think. We'll see what you think about this. Let me get this... Uh, I'll tell you, it's funny. This, uh, this record that we're listening to here, this um, Savage Rose, right? Dude, this freaking pressing, right? Look at this. From the 70s. Look at how... Look at how wobbly that is. I mean, it is... There is nothing there. It's in really good shape, um, but there is just nothing there. I mean, I never even knew way back in the 70s that they made fucking records like this. I mean, this is really, really thin. Um... It's one of the reasons why I think I've never, I've only, well, I have. I listened to it. This is my third time now listening to this record. And every time I do it, I kind of just, like, want to put it back because it's so goddamn thin. It's just, you know, I see these go for, like, 30, you know, average 30, 10, 15 bucks or something on the Internet. This one goes for a little bit more. Um, I actually have another pressing of this waiting in my hold box for somebody that I'm in the BC that I'm getting it for. This is a really nice pressing. The one I'm getting for the, the guy I know, this is actually on the Vertigo Swirl, too, which is always a good sign. Um, Gatefold. This is an import, I believe, from Germany, if I can remember correctly. I believe it's a German import. Um, obviously, I'll show you. It's on that beautiful, and it's in such great shape. Oh, yeah. And that beautiful label, and we'll drop the needle on this and see what you think. I don't know. Let me know, man. Maybe you'll like it, maybe you'll not. And, I mean, there's a good chance you probably have this. You, pr you probably have this record. But I don't see a lot of people showing it, and I don't... Let's vibe on this for a second. Check it 
Yeah, guys. It's all gone now. It's all gone now. You see. Congratulations, man. I'm here. Much love. Have fun. You're the man. It's the only one I got, man. I want them all. Track one, side one. My favorite. I love it. Cherish this. Great record. Great record. psychedelic track though HR is a dirty guitar player I got two copies of this let me know actually I'm I might be getting rid of one I don't know what's going on with it but I think you probably heard this Derek but I think you like this I think if you haven't heard this you would like this really good I mean top class top top fucking class um the Howard Roberts quartet man you would dig that you would take that. Let's drop the needle on another track here. Probably going to get flagged on that. Let's see. Let's go to like track three. I don't even know what, you know, I don't know. I don't remember the track listings on these. I know there's a song in here that's really killer. I just. Time to die. Let's see here. Let's see. We'll drop it on this one. See what happens. This one's really long, this track. This is good. I know you got it. You got it. 
Something that I don't think you have. And I mean, honestly, I don't think you have this. And I honestly think you'd like it. I honestly do, from the bottom of my heart, think you'd like this. Here you go. Sticking with kind of the psychedelic feel, although this is more along the lines of, like, electronic, um, kind of like Fat Boy Slim, but not really. I don't know. I can't explain it. Um, do yourself a favor, though, and check it out. This is I, Munster. I monster. Um, let's check. I'm gonna try to refer you to a track because I don't want to just pull it out and not say the track because there's a track on here that I absolutely love. A dense swarm of ancient stars. Okay, is the name of the album. This is what I think you don't have. I don't think you have this, and I think you would love this. I think you would absolutely, Derek. I think you would love this album. I, I don't only think you'd like this album, I think you also like the band, I Munster. I think I think you like them. They do um, just some good stuff. And I mean it, it I, I can listen to this whole thing and love it and completely be in, in heaven. Um, oh man. Here we go. We're gonna drop the needle. You know what? Well, we had 16 minutes on this. You didn't even make it this far. You turned me off a long time ago. But it's okay. Maybe maybe you stayed. Maybe you stayed around. Well, we're going to do this. The last thing we're going to do, the one that I think you don't have, Derek. I don't think you have this. But i got I got to put my paddle away. Well, here, I'll just lay that right there. How's that? We'll just lay that there. i got, I got cleaning out the ass to do anyway. Here we go. Check those labels out. Look at that. Now, I think it's on this side. Bear with me. I'm not sure if it is. Here we go. Now, I don't think he got this. I think he'd like it. I Monster. Check it out. At first, you're going to be like, what the fuck? But then, you're going to be like, what is this? Right? Listen, what is this? What is that? I don't think he got this. Do you got this? I think you don't like it. They have another app. They, I think it's the only one they have on vinyl, to be honest. Get this, because it's on vinyl, but the other shit they have, really good. Check it out. Just wait. This is like an intro. But, once the intro goes away, I mean, hey, you can get into this, too. records while we're waiting. Going into my, like, normal proggy stuff there, getting into fucking, like, Emerson, Lake and Palmer and shit. Just normal run-of-the-mill shit. I gotta get boxes for this stuff. I'm trying to clear off the shelves and make room for, uh, more obscurity type stuff. Any minute. Trust me, it's coming. Here you go. It's actually track two. I should just want to track two. Here you go. Now, I think you like this. I really do. It is, it's groovy, chillin'. I can get to sleep tonight. I've been thinking of you all day long. Oh, I love it when you make that noise. 
about that. Like it? I don't know. Let's go for a ride again. The thing I like about this album is that if you listen to this album and you look at the pictures here on the front, it goes through like it tells, like you'll see a little bit of all this in the music. It's like a story, man. It's like a concept album, kind of, but of some weird, far out concept. I mean, it's it's a good record, man. So I don't know. That's one I think you probably don't have. So that's it. Derek, man, congratulations on the 250. One day, maybe I'll join you up there with all those subs. Um, take it easy, man. I got to put all this shit away. I have so much stuff to do. Sitting here, busting my ass, putting, putting these records away. So, peace. Congratulations, man. Hope you enjoyed.